important is reaching out technology to the consumers and I think the speed at which they are opening their stores, uh, the footprint is expanding pretty fast. So I think that will really empower the overall environment and the customers as well. Reliance is bang on, they are doing everything right currently in terms of the customer experience, uh, the touch and feel what they are doing it and of course they are backed by a strong customer support which is rescue. So I think they are doing pretty well in all the, all the, all the, uh, absolutely fine. Yeah. I think Reliance already has emerged as probably the number one player on, uh, on on the electronic side, so they need to continue that relation, uh, that lead, and take take things forward. That's the future of this country. Companies which adopt this technology faster will move faster. I think this is the time when consumers really need to empower themselves. I think India should be digital. I don't think it's even a question. We are in a digital age and this is the time now, yes. We are a little slow, but I think uh, the, the coming times it's going to be really fast paced. Uh -huh. Yeah, so it, it goes very fast, I think, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Clearly, I think we are leapfrogging uh, many countries when we are going digital as a country. So I think it's an app title and it's, it's rightly timed as well. Yeah, going digital is a very exciting topic. Actually, that's why we are everybody here and everybody will work hard to drive this trend. The way the 4G rollout is happening, I'm sure the next 12 months are going to be very exciting, both in terms of the service, content, and the infrastructure that India is putting together. Yeah, the concept and our concept are almost the same. So we, we can go ahead mutually for the refrigerator business. You are equivalent in competition to anybody across the world. You are uh, able to throw your ideas or get ideas and you don't really have to invest uh, in real estate state, uh, to really take advantage of this. So digital really helps us without having very high capital cost to be as uh, to be equivalent to anyone in the world or to be more to them. India going digital is a, uh, you know, is a well-known concept now. I guess it's the thing that uh, you know, uh, we are going to work on in terms of uh, the digital field and obviously the uh, brick and mortar and the online will play a much bigger role in terms of the overall economy for the country. It is moving very, very fast beyond the expectation of, I think, uh, the consumers. So it's going the right way and it's going very, very healthy. Well, I think <laughs> the opportunity that exists in India and the fact that India going digital and Reliance contributing to that India going digital campaign is, is is phenomenal. Well, we are the IT capital of the world right now, so I mean, it's uh, going digital is uh, obviously a natural progression. It's an inevitability that was uh, waiting to happen, and uh, uh, yeah, organizations like Reliance Digital are making it happen faster. Uh, I strongly believe and trust after the election, everything will be all right. Just going to uh, you know blast off into a very different sphere altogether. Uh, I think for for several years the electronics retailing was very well con contained into a few formats, but I think it's just bursting out. Uh, retail, I would say, is more about um, experience, right? And uh, uh, so platforms like this, uh, yes, of course, offers the right kind of an experience to the customer. So that's how the retail will evolve in India. So like any other uh, international markets, you can see the mature retail, that's how it behaves. Yeah, this is the picture is going to change completely in the next four or five years. Uh, and it's not only because uh, it's about uh, the infrastructure and the government and the policies, it's also because lifestyle of people uh, are changing very fast. I mean, now people want to really go into the big showrooms and buy stuff. So they are kind of bored with going in the regular mom and pop stores. So I, I foresee a big change which is happening. Um, I think it's only lack of awareness that, uh, you know, I mean, as I think more consumers are exposed to technology, uh, they will want those products. People need to understand uh, what digital exactly is and how it, how the products <coughs> and the way they are sold will make their life better. I think the market is still a little too fragmented. Uh, there is some uh, challenges around how the traditional retail, uh, the digital uh, retail that we have plus the online are going to mesh together. So I think uh, those gaps are more in terms of what is customer expectation and 
only a few uh, organizations like Reliance Digital are able to match up to the customer expectations when they walk into stores. Uh, we have tried to match pace with Reliance at this point of time and I'm sure that I mean, over a period of time in the next two to three years, the, the way Reliance is moving, I think I'm sure we will also be able to match up. We're investing heavily in the right people, right? We're working to develop the right products that suit the market and then really align that closely to the strategic plans that Reliance has to open those different formats to make sure we've got the products developed and placed in the right places. Reliance, at the moment, they are growing up almost a double up every year like same as Samsung. That's why you know Samsung is very much proud, proud of uh, the reliance. Your expansion is incredible. It's probably the fastest in the world in terms of retail. And this is really impressive. And we definitely see this as a huge opportunity for us. Uh, we are aligned and geared to match whatever reliance needs from us in order to address their expansion plans. Have expected this kind of uh, expansion from Reliance for the last four to five years, so we are also, uh, you know, following the footsteps here. I think we are absolutely ready. We have wonderful digital products. Reliance has wonderful channel expansion plans, and they are everywhere. So I think uh, both of us together should, uh, you know, uh, have a great, great uh, force to reckon with in this digital environment. Yeah. In the next two years, I, I see Reliance as uh, our maybe in top three of our partners uh, in uh, Pan India. Oh, it's uh, breathtaking, it's fast paced and we are really excited uh, to try and match step for step what Reliance is doing. They are always known for being on scale and uh, with great speed. So we are definitely, it's a catch up game. See, I mean, uh, Reliance has been a great partner to us and uh, we are also trying to be keeping pace with them. So I don't think so. It's going to be a sort of a help. I mean, it's really helping us push and keep with the times and pace. Always, Reliance Digital, they are making good business, especially, especially for Samsung, the number one partner. Right, and uh, that's why uh, without uh, Reliance support, Samsung, India cannot be survived. Definitely, the Reliance Digital is the, our the most important uh, account uh, to LG Electronics. So we have a very robust uh, business plan with uh, Reliance Digital this year uh, to grow uh, by uh, 40 to 5 percent. So clearly, as we bring in phones and tablets and some of our new products, now with our Motorola acquisition, we look forward to Reliance help us take those products to the market. Devices is our strategy. We actually believe that uh, they actually take these devices to, out to the end consumer. Today we are trying to tie up with them on the service also. So that is really providing the customer the entire solution in one uh, at one place. This is indeed see, the journey has been fantastic for us from the time we opened the first store in 2007 till now. The journey is as good I can get only when you have great company. With all my humility, I really want to thank each one of you for showing the faith in us, for standing by us, in believing in us, and helping us reach this goal. Without your support, without your contribution, without your efforts to push us further ahead, we wouldn't have reached here. So tonight, I'm not going to lay out a new strategy or necessarily a new direction. Hopefully, what I hope to do is to put a fine point on what our strategy really is and how it continues to evolve. And then we'll advise you on some tactics of what we're going to do this year and what you can expect from us. And hopefully create a, a stronger partnership with each one of you so that we can do this together. Because truly, we want to bring technology to life for all of India. So let's start with a few facts. Number one, we're currently present in more than 70 cities. Number two, we have over 2 million square feet of retail space. Number three, we serve more than 30 million customers annually. Number four, if I'm counting properly, we have over 8,000 enthusiasts working in our stores that are daily at our customer service.
now this show that we're talking about about Reliance dig uh, Digital, right? Now, if I start to do digital things, you start to think it's something uh, messed up. So everything in my show will be analog. Do we know each other personally? Yes, I met you. You know, it's amazing. Every time I go to the audience to select people, everybody goes like this. First boyfriend, no way, right? No way. What was his name? His name is Raful. Raful? Yes, that's right. I was close. Oh my God! I'm supposed to be here for the best part, which is the awards. <laughs> so, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much for, for the entire evening.